so I'm about ready to attend a new moon blue lotus tea ceremony. Now I can't take a lot of pictures, especially of anybody that's involved in this, but I'm going to try to get what I can. I'm so looking forward to it and I'm so excited. So that's her right over there. I'm going to get so much. She's preparing. So she just smashed me. Amazing. That is what she does in every class session that we do together. So I just got done. I am so really relaxed right now and it was actually amazing, but I wish I could have recorded all the music that she did. It was pretty amazing. She did give me a lotus flower, which is amazing. So I'm going to be on my way back to where I sleep at night and then I'm gonna go to sleep and I will report tomorrow on what kind of dreams I had. I've set my intention, um, meditated through the Blue Lotus tea ceremony. Ah, I'm buzzing everywhere, all this. So Blue Lotus opens up your intuition your third eye your crown so i'm looking forward to sleeping tonight as you can see i am so very relaxed sending you much love and i will report what my dreams are tomorrow have a good night i just woke up yes bad head i haven't even brushed my hair or taken a shower i just wanted to get on here before I went to bed last night, I did meditation, breath work, and I did some healing because I was called to. On my way back to where I sleep at night, I was called to do healing on myself. I did a lot of dreaming, and I remember every single one of my dreams. There was eight of them. The first one was that I'm supposed to bury my satin spar the one that's broken the the larger one that i've showed you and i'm thinking to myself i live in my suv where am i gonna bury it <laughs> i will find a place i also did a lot of traveling through dimensions i was seeing things of light of colors and literally i was just flying literally flying. I was having an outer body experience and it was amazing. There was nothing bad about it. It was all very positive. It was amazing. That is most of my dreaming was I was in other places that were not earth. We'll just say that. I was in everywhere. Now, there's supposed to be 12 dimensions. Some people say 22. I've been to nine. But in my dreams, I literally was looking at myself sleeping. So I was having an outer body experience. And I was going into places that were... It's just really hard to describe. Like... They are places that people don't even know of. It was 
crazy and amazing all at the same time. The other thing is that I felt so much peace, so much love. There was a, another dream where I was literally watching myself heal myself. And I was watching my body and I was crying. It wasn't like, you know, upsetting crying where you can't catch your breath. I, my eyes were dripping of tears as I was healing my own self. Watching myself heal myself, that, that's un, it, it's, it's almost unbelievable. I can barely even believe it myself, but it was an amazing experience. And yes, I feel that this morning and I will do another video on that later. One of the last dreams I had, and remember after every dream, as I mentioned, I actually woke up, so I barely got any sleep last night. But the last dream that I had was talking, I was talking to this light, and this light, it was a soul, I felt it. It was masculine and feminine, which is really weird, I've never experienced a light soul being being both masculine and feminine but they were just talking to me in this weird language and I have to say that I didn't understand anything what they were saying until I woke up this morning and then everything was clear they talked about awareness and awakening and what the difference is also about vibration and your frequency and ascension. This light soul being explained to me all these things about ascension, all these things that are happening to the world and what's going on. I will be talking about those things, the, the messages. We sat and we talked and hugged. Like that masculine, feminine energy, light soul was so beautiful. Like I really did not want to leave. I wanted just to stay. I wanted to be a part of that world. And that world was so beautiful. That uh, dimension, the soul being just continued to talk to me like I knew what this light being was saying. I just listened. And at times, we are holding hands. And it's hard to explain, but it wasn't really a, f a physical hand, but a light that was uh, extended towards me, and I just held it. It was absolutely beautiful. I was in so much peace. I was in so much awe. I, I, there's so much that I don't even understand and experience this. I've never experienced anything like this before. Something very similar, but not to this extent where I woke up the next morning and understood exactly what our conversation was. The messages that I have to bring. A new moon, blue lotus ceremony opened up my third eye, my crown, my soul star chakra, and it brought me to experiences that I have never experienced before. It's absolutely amazing. Let me know in the comments if you're interested in hearing any of the experiences or the things that were told to me. Sending you so much love.